Savitri, page 167. All here is dreamed or doubtfully exists. But who the dreamer is and whence he looks is still unknown or only a shadowy guess. Or the world is real but ourselves too small insufficient for the mightiness of our stage. A thin life curve crosses the titan world of the orbit of a soulless universe. And in the belly of the sparse rolling mass, a mind looks out from a small casual globe and wonders what itself and all things are. And yet to some unturned subjective sight, that strangely has formed in matter's sightless stuff. A point large, minute of little self, takes figure as world's being's conscious base. Such is our scene in the half-light below. This is the sign of matter's infinite. This the weird purport of the picture shown to signs the giantess measurer of her field as she posed on the record of her close survey and mathematizes her huge external world to reason bound within the circle of sense or in thought's broad impalpable exchange, a speculator in tenuous vast ideas, abstractions in the void her currency. We know not with what firm values for its base. Only religion in this bankruptcy presents its dubious riches to our hearts, our science unprovisioned checks on the beyond. Our poverty shall there have its revenge. Our spirits depart, discarding a futile life into the blank unknown, or with them take death's passport into immortality.